Hi guys, it's Crystal here. Welcome to my channel again. So recently I purchased a whole heap of bourgeois cosmetics off of ozsale.com.au because they had everything under eight dollars I think it was um, so it was a really good deal and I couldn't pass it up and I have done a little thing here with my face with all of the products um, so stay tuned and I hope you enjoy the first thing I did was moisturize and I primed my face with my BB cream and then I'm going to try out the 123 Perfect Foundation and um, I'm not sure if it's going to match my skin color. It looks pretty dark. I think it'll be too dark, but we'll, we'll see. actually not too bad so it seems to go on quite nicely um, I'll have to use it and wear it all I'll have to use it and wear it all day to see that one's also in shade 53 next I'm going to take this healthy mix concealer it is in the shade 51 it has a little nozzle see what this is like That, look, that looks pretty good actually. I'll just blend it in with my fingers. It feels really smooth. Um, I guess it, it blends well into the foundation. Next I'm using this powder. Unifying powder, healthy balance, Asian fruit therapy, high Hydrating and anti shine. Um, just looks like that. I also bought this little kabuki brush from Bourgeois. I don't know if this is going to be the right color either. on all right next I'm going to take the bronzer that I got it says bronzing powder coca bean and orange blossom extract radiance and hydration um, it is for fair to medium skin comes in like this looks like a chocolate bar I guess and it comes in this plastic case so it just looks like this. It's got this little mirror and a little brush and then the bronzer. I'll see how this goes. It might be a little bit too light for my contouring, but we'll see. I probably should have got the dark one. Take a bigger brush and it smells nice. I don't think I've ever had a bronzer that smells nice. <laughs> How random. I actually got two little blushes. This one here is shade 37. They just come with a little brush and a little thing about it. So that's shade 37 and it just looks like that. So that's them together. It's a lot of difference. This one's shade 54 and this one's the shade 37. They seem really pigmented. Um, if you use the 54 you would not need much of it. I might mix them together and see what I get. Shade 37 on first. It might not be dark enough though, that's my worry. Yeah, 
you don't need much of that. I didn't get a highlighter, so I'm just using my um, Lights Capade by MAC. Now for the exciting part. I got this Smoky Blue Eye Trio. So it has those three colors there. This navy colored blue eyeliner. Also got um, this shade 25 eyeshadow, which is a gray. I'm just going to use the NYX eyeshadow base first to on my eyes. Okay, first up, I'm just taking this really light blue color on a flat uh, eyeshadow brush and I'm just gonna put that all over. I'm just gonna pat it on to try and get mo more color. So I'm just gonna put that all over my lid. I'm then going to take the medium color here on a crease brush and I'll just lightly work it in there. This is the bit that I hate. It just takes so long. I take this darker color and just pop it right on the end corner and just kind of swirl it in. I'll work it in a bit with the other color. I'll then take a little smudge brush and just take that medium color and put it a lower lash line. And I'll take it about halfway and I'll just do the same on the top a little bit. And I might just take that darker color there as well on the top. Just keep taking some more of the medium color, the medium blue color and I'll keep working it in there. Just in that corner and the crease. I'll then take a fluffy brush and I'll take the lighter color, the lighter blue, and I'll just blend that a bit more in there. And maybe just a bit on the outside. I'll then take an inner shader brush with that light blue color and I'll pop it on the inner corner and on my lower lash line. I'll then touch up the lighter blue in the middle with that same, that first brush that I use and just pack it on. Then I'll pick up the crease brush and just work it in again. Then I'm going to take the blue eyeliner. Just put it on my lower lash line as well. Just on the outer. Next I'm going to take this mascara. It's mascara volume clubbing. I don't know. Looks like that. I always get waterproof. That looks really good actually. Look at that. Um, I actually really like this mascara. I'll then use the shade 08 and pop it on and pop it there <laughs> whatever that thing's called just on my brows really quickly so I have this 3D volume and shine elixir lip gloss I don't have a lipstick so I'm just going to use this savvy one in pearl pink because it's kind of the same color and I'll just put that over And then this lip gloss as well. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe and I'll see you soon. Bye.